Right. Hello and welcome to Dredge. Um, I am Hylian Mal, and we are starting this game today. Um, it's an indie game that just came out at the end of March. Um, it's about fishing, and um, I've been wanting to play it, so I'm taking a little break from um, Zelda, and we're going to play this. And we're gonna so give me a second to get it all loaded. What is happening here? Mm -hmm. There we go. Okay. Right. There's that. Okay. So here we go. New game. Angler wanted. Job listing, angler wanted. Ooh, 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 ooh. Uh oh. Looks like we crashed. Lighthouse. Here's a cute little town. The morning light fills your eyes and you try to sit upright. You're lying in the cold, wet dock where you collapsed the night before. A short man is shouting orders at a handful of workers disembarking from a boat nearby. The man notices you. Welcome to Greater Mero. I must say, quite the dramatic first impression. I see you've already introduced yourself to the jagged rocks along the bay. Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. Ah, well, I'm glad to see our new fisherman upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged, but I've had a few of the locals move your things to one of our old vessels. We'll catch up later to discuss more details. I'll let you get out there to catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while you get your bearings in the lake. Finally, I don't suppose I need to say this, but get back by sundown before the fog rolls in. Keep a close eye on the time. It can really creep up on you. Okay. Uh, ooh, here's my little boat. Okay, pursuits. Catch fish for the day. I met the mayor of Great Amaro, who sent me out to catch some fish and find my bearings. Seems nice enough. Warned me to be back before nightfall, though. Said something about the fog. Bit dramatic. The mayor asked me to catch as many fish as I can. Okay, um... I can catch, catch coastal fish with my little fishing rod. Basic fishing pole. Okay, um, undock. Move forwards with left stick, use to reverse. Turn with left and right, okay. Rotate camera with right stick, adjust height. Ooh, some fishies. Okay, start fishing. Press square at the right time to reel faster. Oh, okay. Got it! A blue mackerel. Okay. 
Aha. Cool. Got it. And depleted. Okay. Let's find another place. Ooh. Right here, there's some fish. Can I get these? Yes, okay. Oh, man. Ah, come on. There's a bit of a delay when you reel. Cod, okay. Ah. Like, you have to hit it a little early. Okay. I wonder if I could fix that insensitivity. Okay, depleted. Uh, let's try this right here. Oh, this is shallow water. I can't fish that. Okay. What about this? Okay. Oh, this is more of the same one, I think. Another mackerel. Okay. Oh, it's already six o'clock. Oh my gosh. So fast. Turn my light on. Move to fishing spot. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I'm going home <laughs> before I get stuck out here. 7.30. Ah. Uh. Okay. Yay. As I mentioned, your old boat was too badly damaged to be repaired. However, I'm more than happy to sell you the replacement vessel, yours to own. I understand you may not have the necessary funds, so we'll consider it a loan, but I want to make this easy for you. Until your debt is repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. A small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. So to recap, you'll need to sell fish to the local market, paying off your debt, and in turn keeping the population fed and satisfied. Understand? Okay. Our fishmonger will appraise and purchase what you catch. He's open all hours. Off you go then, sell those fish while they're still fresh. You enter a squalid shack on the fringe of the marketplace. The familiar smell of fish fills the air. Flies bud ha buzz haphazardly around a downcast man behind the corner. You're the new fisherman, eh? Surprised they found a new one so fast. What happened to the other one? He... It takes a certain type of person to last out here. It's not a life for everyone. Anyway, to business. I'll pay you for your fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some species are just worth more, too. Other towns on other islands may pay you different, but while you still got a debt outstanding here, I'd suggest you work on paying it off first. Let's see what you got. Sell all the fishies. $102 is what I get to keep. Cool. Excellent work. I have no doubt you'll be able to provide for this town. Look here, I found this down by the docks. I'm sure someone like you could make something out of it. Why don't you take it? Ooh, a research piece. Okay. Our local shipwright mentioned she might be able to make some modifications to your ship. You should pay her a visit. Okay. As you walk into the yard, you see the shipwright making repairs to a damaged hull. She looks up at you briefly before turning back to her work. You must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Mind you, I'm not in the business of doing favors around here. Payment is up front, and everything takes some time to install. Also, if you take any damage on the rocks or any damage at all, I can patch it up. Mostly. She shrugs and gestures towards the hull she's currently working, attempting to repair. A number of wooden boards, all well above the line, are splintered and scratched. Take a look around. Just remember, the bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install, so plan ahead. 
Ooh, I want a fishing rod that'll catch me shallow. $150. Ooh, $75. Uh, can I get it? Yeah, then I could catch shallow fish too. And we're going to rotate it so it takes up less space. Yay! Repair mode. Okay, I don't need to repair anything. What do you have? You have engines, lights. Oh, I need a light. I don't have one. But they're expensive. I don't have that much money yet. Okay. Okay, thank you. Okay, let's check our... Ooh, encyclopedia. So this will show the fish we've caught. A blue mackerel and a cod. Very cool. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna sleep. Ooh, wait, we can use research pieces. Um, so I want to make this rod so that I can, oh, well, this one will catch oceanic, but I want this so I can have one rod to catch both types of fish. Engines, okay. And now, time to go to bed. Okay, let's go fishing. Now we can catch the shallow fish because we have a different rod that'll catch shallow fish. Which I think are these. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Cool. Got it. Oops. <laughs> okay. Cool, that's a new one. Uh, where else do I see some fishies? Over here. Ooh, and out here. Can I get these? Uh, this is the mackerel. Uh, rotate. Got it. Okay. Let's go see what's over here, because there's something over here. That's probably... Oh, that looks like a shark. Yeah, oceanic. I can't fish that. Um, what is this one? This looks like some shallow... Oh, wait. That's probably not fish. Yeah, dredge. I can't get that. Okay, what about this? This is some fishies. Uh, I already have you, but sure. Now we're full. We gotta go sell our fish. Oh my gosh, it's already five o'clock. <laughs> well, I guess this will be it for today once we make it back. Select your lights by holding L1, then toggle them with square. Six thirty.
Okay, fishmonger, buy my fish. Oh, I've had a special order come through from a customer. If you can fulfill it, I'll pay you above normal prices. Ooh, they asked for one gold flounder and one gray eel. Just bring them in when you have them. You'll need to have a rod that can handle shallow water fish in order to catch those. The shipwright should be able to sort that for you. I already did that. Have you got any fish? Yes. Um, okay, so this one... Perfect. Okay, come back when you have everything. Yes. Uh, I got fish. Awesome. Ooh, I'm almost paid off my loan. Uh, do I have any money to buy stuff? 110. I could buy a light, but... Is this rod better? 40% fishing speed, 10%. Meh. It's fine. Okay, let's go to sleep. A hunched woman approaches you from the steps to the lighthouse. She stops some distance away and looks at you with concern and visible apprehension. Oh. Why are you here? I've come to fish. There's nothing here for someone like you anymore. Do yourself a favor and move on. Rude. She turns and shuffles back along the path that leads to the light. Okay, lady. Just the person I was hoping to see. Will you be sailing out east towards Little Marrow? Would you give this package to the dock worker there? Sure. The mayor hands you a small, damp package bound in string. It's dripping slightly. The dock worker will pay you upon delivery. Please be quick about it. I don't want it to spoil. Don't forget to check your compass and map if you get lost. Okay. Well, let's go. Little Marrow, due east. Ooh, lightning! Oh my gosh. Uh, we can fish after we deliver the package on the way back. Our little boat, it's kind of slow, <laughs> but very cute. 8.30 Hi! He tears a small hole in the paper and peeks inside. You can't say for sure, but it feels as though he's shielding it from your view. Yeah, nice and fresh. This will do nicely. I'm to pay you, I suppose. He hands you some money. I was given this old book a few weeks back, but it didn't make much sense to me. You'll surely get more use out of it. Sustainable fishing. He pulls a crumpled book from his back pocket and hands it to you. A number of pages are folded over. Keep it in your cabin. Perhaps you can read it while you're on the water. Stop by for a chat anytime. I know how lonely it can be. Well, thanks. Let's read the book. Uh, oh, right. We need the eel. I delivered the package. Encyclopedia, the flounder was new. Let's read the book. Okay, cool. Um, now we'll fish. Ooh, there's some fish here. Okay, some flounder. I don't want to take too many of these because they take a lot of space. Okay. That's all I'm going to take of those for now because they take up a lot. What about you guys? What are you? Um, some cod. Okie dokie. Okay. Got 
Got it. Okay. Let's go here. Some mackerel. find the eel. Ooh, this looks like it could be eel. <gasps> Yay! Cool! Okay, I got one. 6.30. Fishmonger. Yes, I do. I have your eel. Hooray! Good, good. They should be pleased with these. I've got another order here. This one's a little more curious. They want a couple of squid and a whole black grouper. Don't see many people fishing for squid these days. They only feed at night. And you know, and well, you know that Nights are like around here. Good luck. <laughs> okay, sell the rest of our fish. Cool. Keep an eye out for larger fish. They'll feed more mouths so I can pay you more. Okay. Ah, oh, I almost paid off our debt. Okay, two arrow squid and one black grouper. They only bite at night. Okay. Um the eel. Ooh, I have some money. I could buy a better light. Or a light, because I don't even have one. 750 lumens. Yeah, I want one of these. Let's go to sleep. I don't have any research points, no. Go to sleep. Oh, I could have gone fishing for those night fish, but we'll do that later. I just want to sell enough for my boat to be paid off. And then... I can't put it there because of the light now. Okay, that's okay. Um, over here. Ooh, the music. That's lovely. Okay, let's catch some more eels. No, 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 no. There. <laughs> okay, what are you guys? Coastal, mackerel. Um, ooh. Do that. Okay. 
This over here is probably an ocean fish. They look like sharks. Yeah. Ooh, a message in a bottle. Ooh, can we get that? Yay! Okay, let's see what it is. August 20th, 1927. Morning of the second day of the honeymoon and our first day proper. Today we're sailing around the islands and inlets at the back of Greater Merrill. I love the rocks here. The layers and colors are so striking. Furthermore, the fishing is relatively poor in these shallows, so I know he'll keep his hands on the wheel instead of off the uh, instead of the rods. He renamed the boat last night last night Julie. He did a fancy renaming ceremony and everything. I think he took that more seriously than the wedding. Supposedly, it's very important to perform it correctly, lest you want ill fortune to follow the vessel. He wanted to throw away everything with the old name on it, but I kept the keychain Ocean's Riches. It was a good name. I think he has prepared a surprise picnic lunch. I can see the basket half hidden, stuffed under a blanket at the front of the cabin. I love it when he tries to be romantic. <laughs> Cute. Okay. Ah! Don't hit the rock. Okay, let's see what kind of fish these are. Ooh, we could try fishing at night. It's going to be night here shortly. Um, ooh, I don't really have room for this. <laughs> okay. Sustainable fishing complete. 10% chance to not reduce fish stocks when catching a fish with a rod. Cool. Ooh, a squid! Yay! Okay, we needed that. I have nowhere to put you, do I? Well, we could get rid of one of these. Yeah. Okay, so we got the squid. Oh my goodness, it is so dark. Ah! Go towards the light. <laughs> light is safety. <laughs> Exposure to fog and other things increase your panic. Bright lights and sleeping will reduce it. Okay. Cool. Yes. Leave whatever you have. I'll keep the order. Oh, he wanted two squid. Well, I'm glad I took two. Okay. Cool. Uh, sell the fish. Yay! I don't think I owe anything anymore. Yay! The mayor is walking quickly towards you. He seems to be in a good mood with a spring and a step. Fantastic news! Thanks to thanks partly to your efforts, Greater Marrow is growing. Our town is sure to be swarming with visitors any day now. In fact, I've granted a consent for the shipwright to expand her facilities. The old dry dock is operational again. I've also allocated some money to improve the fishmonger's services. He might have something to talk to you about soon. Keep up the good work. We're glad you've chosen to be here with us. Dry dock. This is the dry dock. We can make significant improvements to your vessel here. We're talking extra space, more attachment points for equipment, and even superior holes. We'll need a decent stock of hard materials for these projects. Lumber, metal scraps, that sort of thing. How do I do it? There's plenty of decent materials around the coast from various shipwrecks and the like. I'm sure you'll find a way to get at them. Materials assigned towards upgrades here will be stored, so don't worry if you only have half of what we need. Okay. Cool. Okay. Um, 
How much money do I have? 200. Mm. Ooh. Encyclopedia, arrow, squid. Okay. Um, uh, I need to fish at night to get the other one. Her suits. How do I check that? There. A black grouper. Let's see if I can find it before I go to sleep. And just not go too far. <laughs> Ooh, there's some fish here. Oh, this is squid. Okay. Okay, I want a grouper though. Turn my light on. Ooh, here we go. This looks like it. Yay! Okay. Oh, ew! Okay, well, time to go. It's three in the morning. Don't hit the rocks. Okay, hurry, hurry. No, my light's going out. Ugh. Okay. Yes. Got it. Wraps up the fish and hands you some money. I didn't think you had it in it. You. Night fishing is a tall order. Been meaning to talk to you about a new business venture I've been considering. Crab pots. Ooh, yes. I've got one here for you, in fact. It's a bit banged up, but you could get it fixed at the shipwright. Yes, please. Let's put it here with the engine. Just drop it out at sea anywhere, then come back after a day or two to check on it. I've got a customer after a fiddler crab and a common crab. Both species can be found around here. What is it today? You hand the grotesque fish to the fishmonger. He grins, raising the fish up to his face before inhaling a deep, stuttering breath. Ah, now, this is the sort of specimen to liven up my day. Hmm, I wonder. He runs his fingers firmly along the length of the fish as though feeling for something. He pushes from one side of its stomach and a small shape can be seen against the bulging scales. He slices the fish opened. From its stomach, he pulls a small piece of fabric and spreads it on the counter. It's a delicately patterned handkerchief. Well, I've never seen that before in all my days. I'll give you this thing and I'll pay you for the fish too, of course. It's not the first corrupted fish I've seen in these parts, so I'm sure you'll find more before long. I'll pay you well if you find any more. Handkerchief. Okay, um, can I buy more crab pots? How much are they? 100? Yeah, we'll buy another one. Um, and we'll put it here. Okay, so we have two crab pots. Okay, a man is looking at you through your cabin window. His face is mostly in shadow. I know what you took to the fishmonger, and I'll be clear. I know he extracted an artifact from it. I need to inspect it, but not here. Meet me on Blackstone Isle. Head out of this bay and cut south. I have a business proposition that you'll want to hear. I'll be waiting. Okay. Not creepy at all. Pursuits. Get Fiddler Crab and Common Crab. Meet at Blackstone Isle. Okay. A map. 
Um, oh, that must be Blackstone Isle. The one on the... With the X on it. Okay. Encyclopedia. Let's see. Okay. Cool. Okay, time for bed. Because we are very tired. Um, can we get anything here? Ooh. Yes. Repair mode. Uh, she's going to repair my crab pot. Place our crab pots. Select the crab pot ability with L1 and deploy it with square. Okay. They catch things over time but need repairing every so often. Okay. So we have two. So we'll put them like right here. Okay. What do we got here? Okay, we need to go south to Blackstone Isle, take the handkerchief. Oh. Ooh. Dang it, I can't get that. Ooh, fish, what are these? Can I get these? Yes. Okay, where can I put you? There. Okay. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Perfect, put it there. Hee <laughs> okay. Ooh, what's this? There's a fish here. Let's let's see what you are. Then we'll go to this little island. <clears throat> Mackerel. Okay. Ooh, trophy. Cool. My hold is almost full. <laughs> and we're full. Can't catch any more fish. Okay, hurry up. Go to the island. Talk to this guy. Okay. Ruined mansion. The man is standing in a doorway watching you approach. He's holding an old book in one hand. It's bound in crimson with silver ribbons. You came. Good. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm a collector of many things, art and artifacts, treasures and truths and curios that occupy the periphery of desire. And you have something for me. You give the handkerchief to the collector. He holds it up to the flickering light and studies it. These patterns are unmistakable, even after all this time. This handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for. It sank many years ago. It carried items of great importance, as you can imagine. Retrieving them is proving to be challenging. That's where you come in. My proposition is this. I will outfit your vessel with equipment that will let you dredge wrecks and dark depths. Hooray! Uh, find me these lost relics and I will reward you in ways beyond all imagining. You need not give up your fishing career. I'll merely need a few hours with your vessel to make the necessary alterations. What do you say? Um, yes. I hope my fish won't spoil, but let's do it. Okay. 
The relics we're looking for are a ring, a necklace, a watch, and a music box and key. I would encourage you to ask around the towns about shipwrecks or other strange occurrences, anything that might be worth investigating. Return when you have something. Okay. Let's... Ugh. My fish are going to get spoiled if I don't go. Search for relics. Okay. So let's go home and then... Ah, don't hit the rock. Okay. Hurry, hurry. Ooh, don't hit the rock. Oh my gosh, no. I lost a little fish. Ugh. It's okay. It's just a blue mackerel. Okay. Hurry to the fishmonger. We'll get our crab pots in the morning. Okay. Fishmonger. Ooh, a book. Thanks. Okay, um, sell fish. Cool. Okay, thanks, dude. Uh, can you fix? Yes, please. Okay. Do you have anything else that I could buy? Ooh, I could buy an engine to make myself faster. Yes. Cool, now my engine's a little bit faster. Okay. Um. Lighthouse Keeper, what is it? Do you know of any shipwrecks? She eyes you suspiciously. There's a spot near the back of Greater Merrill where the current carries in wreckage from the sea. Some nights you can see an unnatural glow rising from that patch of dark water. I can't imagine what's down there in the deep. So if you're looking for what I think you're looking for, it's best you just move on. Okay. Um, have you heard of any strange things happening? I see plenty of strange things from atop the lighthouse. Sometimes I don't know whether or not I can trust my own eyes. She holds the lantern up so that it shines brightly onto mm -hmm. your face. Are you really standing here in front of me, or is this just another of the fog's tricks? Okay. Mm -hmm. Who lives on Blackstone Isle? I see a lot from up here, you know. I saw that ill-fated boat return. I chose to look the other way. I watched an unnatural glow flicker through those windows. Whatever you've got planned, I hope you know what you're doing out there. Okay. Bye. <laughs> uh... It's 1.30. Builder, you approach a woman sitting on the dockside, staring out to sea. She turns to you. What's it like out there? Um, peaceful? It's gotta be a damn sight better than this bloody town. I think I just need to get away for a while. Maybe not come back. Going backwards is a mistake, don't you think? You should always keep moving forward, moving along. It's not so bad here. She's gazing out to sea again, lost in thought. Say, if you find me some materials, maybe you can help me move? I mean, really move. There's an island I've heard about, Steel Point, just to the north. Two units of lumber and two units of scrap is all I need. I can make a new place for myself out there. You'd be welcome to visit, too. Just stack it up at Steel Point when you have anything. I'll pay you when the job's done. Okay. Um, bedtime. Okay, let's check on... Ooh! New book to read. Steel Point... Okay. Um, let's read this new book. And let's get our crab pots. Ooh, Fiddler Crab. 
Okay, what's this one got? Ooh, a common crab. I need both of those. Uh, put it up here. It's a tiny. Okay, let's go back and give him those. Ugh, are you kidding me? What? Ugh. Yes. Yay! I have one final request for you. As you've seen, some fish around here can develop odd deformities. What do you think happens when a person eats the flesh of those mutants? They go mad? Perhaps, but I want to know for sure. Bring me a mutant fish. Any will do. Just keep this between the two of us. Okay. You got it. Ugh, I have to fix my stupid ship now. $60. Okay. <sighs> well, she gave me a book. A weird fish. Okay. Um, I need... Can I check the sensitivity? Let's see. Tutorials. <laughs> Camera. Audio controls. Okay. Oh. Camera sensitivity. I don't know if I want... Hmm. Well, we're just gonna leave it, I guess. Okay. Um... Here we go. Let's do some more fishing. No more hitting rocks. Ooh, I can dredge stuff now. So let's hunt for some um, materials, maybe. Fish. Okay. Uh, oh, they said on the back of Greater Marrow there's a shipwreck where I might find materials. So we'll go that way. Ooh, there's a message in a bottle over here. Let's go get it. I'm a little faster with two engines. August 21st. We had a slight accident yesterday around the shallows at the back of Greater Marrow. A rock seemingly appeared out of nowhere and struck the front of the boat. It did not penetrate the hole, but it jostled us around and a few items fell overboard into the water. We did not see what they were, which is of some concern, but we believe all important articles are accounted for. He's been checking over some notes from the boat remaining renaming ceremony. He's paranoid that he performed the steps incorrectly. I've never known him to be so superstitious. Okay, um, ooh, there's stuff here, and some fish, <gasps> dolphins, um, mackerel,
Okay. Ooh, a weird one. Cool. Well, the fishmonger will love that. Okay, what's this? Ooh, this is cool. Let's see if we can get it. Okay, press. Ah! Ah! Oh my god. This is hard. Ah! Jesus. Okay. Yeah. Ah! Uh, can you slow it down? Oh my god. Ah! Stop! Okay. Ah! Oh my god, stop! Okay, try again. Okay. There we go. Got it. Ugh. Okay. Uh, oh, it's a research piece. Cool. I thought it was going to be a piece of cloth. Okay. Try again. Come on. can do it. Okay. You really got to pay attention. <laughs> Another one. Okay. Oh, I need to leave, or I am going to get panicked for sure. Ugh. Another research part, okay. Just leave it, just leave it, just leave it, just leave it. Thank God. Okay. Piece of cloth. Um, this is a lot harder than the fishing. Okay, but I think I figured it out. <sighs> okay. That was intense. What do we got here? Oh. Ah. Once you get in a bad rhythm, it really messes with you. Okay, um, read this book. <sighs> Alright, let's try again. Is it possible to slow it down? It's a little too fast. If I keep doing that, it's not gonna come up. Uh, I don't want completely to get rid of it.
Thank you. Okay. Um. No, all my fish rotted. Damn. Because I spent too long out here. Shit. And I had a weird fish. Okay, well, let's... Uh, I'm gonna have to figure that out better. <sighs> um... Yeah, it's rotten. Well, yes, you see, my only son was lost at sea some years ago. Um, he's still out there somewhere in one of those wrecks, all alone in the cold, dark water. The man is clearly trying his hardest to remain composed, but tremors of grief rack his body. I was wondering, I noticed you have some dredging equipment installed on your vessel. If you're able to retrieve any of his belongings from the wreck, I think he'd feel more at peace if his mementos were with me. He wore a bronze belt buckle, specially engraved. I'd recognize it anywhere. If there's a chance you could find it, I'd be in your debt. Oh, I found it already. Give the belt buckle to the man. Yes, you give the belt buckle to him. This is this is his. Oh, thank you. Bless you. You've returned him to me. Please take this. I've not any money to pay you, but this might hold some value. Yay. Anything else I can help you with? I don't get out a lot anymore, so I don't see much of what goes on, but I do remember the old mayor in his final days. What an awful sight it was, screaming and throwing things into the sea. Throw it back, he would cry over and over, begging anyone who would listen, howling it to the wind. These days, I almost feel like I understand. Okay, bye. Um, let's sleep, because we're panicked. It's very high panic. Okay. Okay, can we do our research now? Yes, so let's do this. Awesome. Let's do this. And... How many do I have left? I have two. One on each of these. Or we'll just do that. And then the next ones we get, we'll do this one, and then we'll have that one. Okay, so we can get an oceanic, and we can get this rod so that we could do both. Oh, I should have put it in an engine. Oops. We'll do engines next. Um, okay. Let's go... Back. We'll check on our crab pots. Uh, you know, well, okay, let's do some fishing. Okay. Okay, those are so big. Okay, let's catch these. What are these? Ooh, okay. Oops. <gasps> Ooh, a weird one. Yes, we could take this to um, him. Okay.
Let's check on our crab pots. Ooh, what kind of fish is this? Oh, some mackerel, sure. Okay, crab pots. Ooh, um, I don't have room. Hang on, I gotta sell these fish and then I'll get the crab pots. And I gotta repair them. Okay, fishmonger. Yes, I do. Here you go. Oh no. Hey, thanks. Silence. In the stillness of the room, his hands begin to tremble. His face grows anguished. Please, sell what you need, then leave. I must deal with this creature. Okay. Um, that's it for now. Bye. The fishmonger's door slams behind you. You hear the heavy scraping of a metal bar sliding across it. Okay. Okay, so let's do some research. Um, we want this improved engine. Cool. Uh, and we want this one. Okay, and now we will check on our crab pots. Okay, uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Ooh, yay. Uh, we need to pick up the pot, because... Ah, stop. Okay, and then check this one. So let's go repair the crab pots. <laughs> Apologies. Okay. Um, oh, we can't sell them. Because he closed his door. The door is barred from the inside. Damn. Uh, okay. Can we repair our crab pots? $30. Okay, those are repaired. Cool. Um, ooh. <gasps> okay, let's buy the rod that does both. $460. Well, crap. And 410 Okay, so let's sell this and this one. And then I want the one that does both, which is this one. Awesome. Okay, do I have enough? No, I do not. So I need to save up and I can't get the better engine. Um, unless I sell Oh, I can't sell that. Okay. This one sells for 50. No, so I still couldn't get it even if I um... Okay, so I need to save up for the oceanic rod. Um, I can't sell my crabs. Boo! Okay, how much is this one? 330, but I don't even need that yet. Um, let's go put our crab pots back. And maybe find some materials since I can't sell any fish right now. Okay, we're going to put our crab pots over here by this buoy. Cool. And it is 
seven o'clock almost. What is this fish? Hee <laughs> hee. Okay. Um. Ooh, a squid. Sure. Oh, it's depleted. Okay. Well, it is seven fifty. Okay. Um, we can't sell right now. We have a couple things to sell, but we're gonna go to bed. And maybe in the morning we can go to him and hopefully it won't be rotten. Still barred from the inside, damn. Okay, it's not rotten yet. pots okay we need to start fishing for or dredging for materials I don't want to go for fish yet because I can't sell it and I don't want it to rot so fish oh yay I finished my book cool that's an ocean fish this looks like some materials. So let's see if I can do this. Ooh, I think this is the metal scrap. Yay, okay, that was better. Got it. Oh, a research piece. Another piece of metal, cool. Okay, we got some metal. Um, we need to take it to the backside of uh, one of the islands for um, the girl that wants to move. So let's go do that. I believe it's this way. We'll go through the rocks here. Just be very careful. I'm pretty sure it's this way, this little island over here. I think. Come on, boat. You can make it. Oh, is it not this way? I thought it was. Oh, I'm gonna get lost. Ooh, that's a big looking fish. I want it. Crap, it might not be this way. Oh, damn. Yeah, definitely not. We're gonna get stuck out here. Okay, just hurry up. Let's go back. Turn the light on. Okay. Rock. No, no. Light, you must stay on. Okay, here we go. This is the way back to town. Do not hit the rocks. Go very slowly. Crab pots, cool, thank you. Okay. That was not where the little island is. I don't know where it is. Fishmonger, oh, hi! <gasps> Yay! Rotting, but not rotten. Research. Cool. 
Well, now we can buy that one when the time comes. Okay. Um... Okay, where is she? Let's ask her. What did you want me to do? Island to the north. Steel point. Okay. Okay. Um, cool. So what do we have? We need... More money. Okay, let's go north. And keep fishing along the way. Ooh, let's check our crab pots. What do we got? North. going north. Ooh, what's this? Is this eel? Okay, we got a lot of stuff in here. <sighs> North. Oh, well, we gotta go sell our fish, or they're gonna get rotten. Dang it. Okay, let's hurry, sell our fish, and then head north. Because we need money. <laughs> Fishmonger. Okay. Sell. 147. Cool. We need 410 to buy the oceanic rod. So, can't get it yet. Now we're going to go north. To the island to, to put the scrap that we found. Oh, it's that little island on the right. Catch these fishies. Cool. Okay. Hurry up before it gets dark. Those are probably some ocean fish. I don't think I could catch those. Okay, this is where she wants the stuff. So... Okay, material pile. Okay, so we can put... Oh no! I don't have it in my storage. Or I have it in storage. And I can't get it from storage. Crud. <sighs> well, we're going to have to go all the way back, sell our fish, get our stuff, and then come all the way back. Well, good to know. Can't get it from storage. Okay, we have the scrap, but we still need wood. So if we see any dredge, 
We should try to get it. That's probably it over there. Hello! Nice name, Jedi Singer. Must be a Star Wars fan. Thanks for joining. Okay. What are those? Is this going to give me special fish? Let's try. Yes! Death grows. Okay. All right, let's pick up our materials and sell our fish. Ugh, they take up so much room. $306. I still need another $100. Okay. So let's go towards that island and look for dredge along the way. Fish, fish. Fish. I need materials. Ooh, maybe there's some materials over here. Let's go look. Here's your metal. Okay, now we just need the wood. Okay. This looks like materials. Ah, oh, this is cloth. some materials here. What we got? Uh... Oh, treasure. Cool. Okay. This looks like it could be wood. Yes. I need it. Ah. Awesome! Great. Perfect. Let's deliver it and then we'll sleep here. Oh my god. What is that sound? No, 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 no. That's terrifying. gonna sleep. Cool. Encyclopedia. Okay, go tell the builder. Um, let's put this in... Oh, I can't. Ooh, can we go sell that? Let's do that first. Okay, off we go. Okay, um, the island with the artifacts dealer is I think this one over here on the left. So 
so we're gonna sell the goblet to him. I got something. You enter a brightly lit shop. It's packed with antiques, the shelves full of jewelry and other baubles. An old man peers at you over silver spectacles. Hello? Is that? No. Ah, I don't believe we've met. Forgive me, my eyes aren't what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets you happen to have. Have you got anything nice with you today, perhaps? Yes, I do. Sell for a $35. Okay. Oh, wait. Um, storage. I could add this to storage. Okay. And then... We're gonna go back and tell the builder that we finished... Ooh, but we could fish along the way. We still need money to buy the ocean rod. Oh. What do we got here? These look like some small fish. Mackerel. One more. Nice. Okay. So now, go back, sell our fish. Ooh, our crab pots have stuff in it, but I don't have any room. fish. Ooh, we have enough to buy the rod, I think. I think, I think. Okay, let's see. Um, shipwright. 410. Yes! We can buy it. Yahoo! Awesome. Okay. We have $74 left. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Um, well, unfortunately, I actually have to stop playing even though I don't want to. Because um, I have things I have to go do today. But this is a good place to save. Um, when we come back, we will take the builder to her new area and go fo fishing for some ocean fish. So we're going to save. All right. Well, this game is super fun. Um, I hope anyone that's watching um, enjoys it. And we will see you in the next one.